Alright, so I'm going to be showing that the Necromage perk, or in this case, the Bloodworm Helm, because it has an effect that duplicates the Necromage perk, can increase the buffs you receive for going in a beast form, which is your werewolf form. Alright, so as you can see, I have beast form, I have vampire lord. I'm using the hybrid glitch, and it's a glitch, it's not a mod. Uh, you can look it up if you want, but we're going to keep this short and sweet for right now. I'm going to show you that the Bloodworm Helm is working as a Necromage duplicate because Necklace Remedy, health regenerates 20% faster with a 25% increase, that should bump it up to 25%, right? Active effects, Necklace Remedy, 25%, so Necromage is currently working. The next thing we're going to do is we're going to go check out my baseline health and stamina. You can see they're both in white numbers, which means that's my baseline, it's not receiving a buff from anything at all, right? So when you go into beast form, normally you get plus 50 health and plus 100 stamina. If you have the Animal Vigor Werewolf perk, which I do, it will increase both of those by a further 100. And then, if you factor in the Necromage or Bloodworm Helm increase of 25%, that should bump up the buffs you receive to plus 187.5 health, and the .5 will taper off, and plus 250 stamina. So in beast form, if everything is working, I should have 467 health and 390 stamina. So let's see what happens in beast form. And as you can see, 467 health and 390 stamina. So yes, the Bloodworm Helm, which is a Necromage duplicate, is working in beast form. And the reason that's happening is because there's another glitch that's tied to vampirism. And that glitch says that uh, if it were to happen, when you get cured of vampirism, your main flag is undead, even though you're cured of vampirism. And that's what's happened with this character. So every time you go into beast form, what happens is you get cured of vampirism, you get your werewolf buffs, and then you get your armor removed, right? So, I've just been cured of vampirism, but I'm still flagged as undead, so the effect from the Bloodworm Helm is still carrying over to increase my health and stamina. Uh, if you're a character that does encounter this glitch, it'll happen 100% of the time. You'll remain flagged as undead no matter how many times you're cured of vampirism, because every time I go into Vampire Lord, I get vampirism, and every time I go into Werewolf form, I get cured of vampirism, so no matter how many times I do that on this character, he will always remain flagged undead, and he will get the benefits of the Bloodworm Helm or Necromage, no matter what. Alright, so if you have a character that it doesn't work on, in my experience, it will never work on them. And so you kind of just have to get lucky and make a character that it will work on, and it seems to be something that is determined by the character, not, you know, how many times you get and get cured of vampirism, but I could be wrong. But it seems like it's a 50-50 whether or not the character will or won't remain flagged undead. And then if they do remain flagged, they'll always remain flagged. If they don't remain flagged, they'll never remain flagged. All right. And maybe the best way to see if you have a character that will remain flagged is you make the character, right? You go get Vampirism immediately, and then you go to Morthal to get Falion to cure you, and then you pick up the Bloodworm Helm. And if the Bloodworm Helm still behaves with the Necromage Vampirism-like effect then your character is still flagged as undead, and if you go make your character a hybrid, it should be good to go to get this benefit right here. And then if it doesn't, you're probably going to have to make a new character if you're trying to get the, uh, the increased tier werewolf buffs using Necromage or Bloodworm Helm. I have no idea what causes it. Really wish I did, because if I knew what caused it, I could control it, and it would make things a whole lot easier. But for the moment, it seems to be based on luck. But yes, Necromage and Bloodworm Helm can boost your werewolf buffs. 